Hello guys, today we learn how to install SQL Server Reporting Service SSRS. To install this, we need to install SQL Server Data Tool SSDT for Visual Studio for below than 2019 Visual Studio. If you need to download the SQL Server Data Tool for Visual Studio 2015, the following link will be useful like SQL Hack, SQL Server Data Tool for Visual Studio. Now let us open. When you click uh, the this URL will be open like SQL Hack, SQL Server Data Tool for Visual Studio 2015. You can also see that and go to bottom and here you can see if you need to download the SQL Server Data Tool for Visual Studio 2015 the following link will be useful like download SSDT for Visual Studio. You need to click on this. Then you will go here like SSDT for Visual Studio 2015. And here you can see download SSDT for Visual Studio 2015. You need to click on this. And you can see download will be started like SSDT 14.0617 and when you download tabs you can see here already I have downloaded like SSDT 14.0617.12.50 for installation this we need to click right click and then mount so when you mount then it will come in dvd drive and you need to click on this run as administrator and click yes uh, if you have not sql data tools then it will be go for installation already i have a ssdt so you need to click modify and then you need to check sql server reporting services then now here you can select the sql server reporting services <coughs> then need to update then after that installation will be started for SSRS now you can see download in progress installation in progress It will take some time, so please wait for complete this. Here your installations will be complete. Now you, you will go for SQL Server Data Tool for 2015 and open it. Now it will go in for open. You can see Microsoft Visual Studio Tools has been opened. Now and you go to project and you need to click in intelligence then you will get like reporting server reporting services then i open the reporting services
now here you can see it in the reporting project there are three types three folder share data share data set and reports you can see now first you need to connect report to sql server here we required computer name and put server name and sql server authentication then put here SN password, whatever your SQL Server database password, and OK. After that, you can test the connection test. So data source will be updated now, and you will go now data sets. In data set, also need to assign the connection strings. So you can. put like username password i put sa and password 1234 and here you can see so here you can see installation of sql server data tools for reporting services srs has been installed and also we see one reports which connect to database and drag and drop like uh imply id imply name and, and imply location so that's also report will be dis displayed for installation of sshdt in visual studio 2022 or visual studio 2019 let us see how can we install if you have visual studio 2022 or visual studio 2019 already installed you can now edit the list of workloads to include ssdt if you don't have visual studio 2019 or 2022 installed then you can download and install visual studio 2022 Launch the Visual Studio Installer in the Windows Start menu. You can search for Installer. In the Installer, select for Edition of Visual Studio that you want to add SSDT to, and then choose Modify. Then after that, you need to select Data Storage and Processing. Then when you select, then option will be enabled like Data Storage and Processing, and you need to check SQL Server Data Tools. Then Installation will be installed. SSDT will be installed through the itself 2022 or 2019.
Thanks for watching my YouTube videos. If you want to more videos, please subscribe my YouTube channel.